This is the west wall of my garden shed. And in the summer, the heat on the back side of that wall was absolutely unbearable. So I started lining the back of that wall and then filling that wall with rice husks. The following summer, the results were in. It's a super success. So the way I get my rice husks in the cavity wall is by using some old flashing I had lying around. I've taped the underside of it. <clears throat> I've taped the inside of it. And I now load this dust free husk doing it a little bit at the moment because I'm holding the camera and I just tip it in there. Maybe I can set the camera up here so you can see what I'm doing. I can hear that it's almost at the top sound is different. <clears throat> I will use a hammer to whack the inside of the wall so that it settles now and not later. This is rice husk taken directly from the mill. In order to remove the silica dust and I think the lignin, I've made this contraption to shake the dust out. It works very well. This is the rice husk without the dust. Look, you can't see any dust. Well, there might be a tiny bit, but I'd say most of it's out. <clears throat> so I'll now take this large bucket of dust-free rice husk inside and start filling this afternoon's cavity, fall, cavity wall that I'm working on.
So once these panels have been filled up with rice husks, we have a gap at the top because the full sheet is about 1.8 meters. <clears throat> so I'm going to show and share with you how I put the final bit of rice husk at the top here. I use light weighted cards. So I've scooped up a card full of husk <clears throat> and I precariously balance on the ladder and hold the camera all at the same time. I come up here and I slip it in here with the other hand. Let's see. Okay, I've done it. Okay, and I just push it in like that. I'm making a mess because I'm holding the camera. It's actually almost to the top. And that is what I do. Now, when it does get right to the top and it's almost there, I will actually angle these out a bit. So it's kind of bloated and I'll show you what happens next. So, when the panel is put on here and pushed in, that will lift up. That's the, that's the idea. That will all rise up and hit the underside of this member here. I think I can squeeze just a little bit more in and then we'll put the panel on. Time to get the final panel on. So panels on. It's got the right slope there for the ceiling. And I'll work on that panel tomorrow. And those two tomorrow. There's work, other work to be done.